Well, good Saturday morning, everyone. If you were one of those people that thought, ah, oh, we're done with snow for the year. Unfortunately, you were wrong because we had more accumulating snow last night. And you can see not metropolitan crippling amounts of snow, but enough to sort of slicken things up. Uh, the official number at the Weather Service in Highview was 1.1 inches, but you can see some of the more impressive numbers here, uh, an inch or so. I did see uh, in and around the entire state a couple of two inch amounts, but you know what? There is warmer weather on the way. In fact, the Climate Prediction Center is saying as we look ahead towards spring, this is their spring outlook, so March, April, and May, there is some confidence in above average temperatures. Now, the further north and east you go, that confidence increases. But yeah, for our area, there is some confidence in above average temperatures and above average precipitation as we get into the spring months. So it could be a warm and wet spring as we head into the spring months, which actually March uh, just a couple of weeks away. So yeah, get ready for that. Now in the short term, as we go through the rest of the morning, really not too bad. We will see decreasing clouds, but very cold temperatures struggling to get out of the upper 20s and into the lower 30s. As our storm system is well off to the east, it continues to press off the eastern seaboard. High pressure builds in from the west. That will help to continue to clear our skies, but that will sort of work against us tonight because that will allow temperatures to really fall and Sunday morning will be even colder than it was this morning when we woke up. And you'll see that here as we put future casts into motion. You see all those clouds starting to filter off toward the east so that by late this morning into the afternoon hours, we will see plenty of sunshine, but temperatures really not going anywhere throughout the day and into the evening. And notice here by the time we get to tomorrow morning, lower 20s across the region, maybe a couple of isolated upper teens as well. So a very chilly day is shaping up. And then as we go through our Sunday, a little bit warmer, but really not that much. So mid thirties today, well above or well below, I should say where we should be for this time of the year, which is in the forties, just about everybody in the deep freeze today. And then tonight, as I said, those temperatures very chilly into the teens and twenties. There's a look at that extended forecast, which does feature warmer temperatures. President's day is looking nice and into the sixties by the middle part of next week.